Is it Mr Pincher? Mr Pincher? Oh, hello. Hello, it's Dan from Sky News. Hi. I was just wondering if you'd like to just tell us a little bit about, about the events of the last four weeks. That's uh, all. Sorry, Dan. I'm not okay. uh, could you just tell us a bit about what happened at the Carlton Club back in June? Sorry, Dan. Would you um, give us your reaction, of course, on your resignation, of course, brought down the Prime Minister? Um, you must have some thoughts about what's happened over the last month. Anything at all you'd like to say to um, the people who've made allegations against you, Mr Pincher? There's an opportunity for you to perhaps apologise to them. Would you like to say any words to these people? Well, let's just look back on the, the 30th of, of June. You said that you had uh, drunk far too much uh, that night, Mr Pincher. What exactly happened in the Carlton Club? Would you mind telling us what happened at all? I mean, obviously, those, those people that you embarrassed, you say you embarrassed yourself and others, this is an opportunity f simply if you wanted to, to apologise to them. Is that not something you want to do? Thanks, Dan. I've got no comment to make. Thanks. W would you care to do an interview with Sky News, you know, in the, in the coming days then? Perhaps, but thank you very much. Okay. Is there a reason why you don't want to address any of the, the concerns? Obviously, we've not heard from you for was it nearly four weeks now. So, Is there a reason, Mr Pincher, why you don't want to speak? Thanks, Dan. Thanks very much. Nothing at all you want to say to those people who've made very serious allegations going back years, which has brought down a Prime Minister? Thanks, Dan, very much. Thank you. Nothing at all, Mr Pincher, at all. Thanks, Dan. Thank you. Can you at least tell us why you felt you had to resign, at least, then? Not going into the allegations, but, but why you felt it was definitely a, a resigning matter? What did you mean by the fact that you'd embarrassed people that night in the club? Do, do you not think the people deserve to hear from the person who's obviously brought down a Prime Minister, started a new leadership election and of course, most importantly, uh, have heard about serious allegations made against you over the years? <clears throat> you simply don't want to address those allegations at all, even an apology. I mean, it is an opportunity, Mr Pincher, to give an apology to those people, even if just a few words. Thanks, Dad. If you just leave me alone for a moment, thanks. Okay. Are we stop? Yep.